Hello students, Instructor Pamela here. I would like to give you a big warm welcome to our Law and Ethics course. As a healthcare professional, it's very imperative that we follow the professional standard guidelines uh, for patient care, both clinical and non-clinical. That's why certification is very imperative within the healthcare industry. Not only are coders and billers certified, of course also the clinical staff have to obtain and maintain their certifications as well, and the facilities. Keep in mind that not all healthcare facilities are accredited by Joint Commission. That's the key here, accreditation from Joint Commission. There are some facilities that do not operate under such standards and guidelines from Joint Commission. So that's kind of going to a school that's not accredited. So in healthcare, it's very imperative to have, again, the accreditation and maintaining it through standards, through their um, processes and procedures. As medical billers and coders, we have the option to obtain certifications through AAPC, American Academy of Professional Coders, as well as AHIMA, A-H-I-M-A. And these certifications are obtained through taking a three-hour, uh, three well, it's actually six-hour um, exam and passing it. And then you would have to submit your continuing education units um, each year and then also pay your membership fee. Again, these are very imperative for us as healthcare professionals to have our certifications and maintain them. It does back us up, quote unquote, as far as being held responsible for unethical practices within the facility um, that you may be working for. So it is your responsibility as a healthcare professional to always maintain that integrity. If you feel that you're working for a facility that is not up to par, please be sure to always take that initiative to report it. We like to call those quote unquote whistleblowers. But if you feel that procedures that are occurring in your facility are not ethical to the standards of Joint Commission and overall healthcare, please be sure to report the facility. Again, your responsibility as a healthcare professional is to take care of the patients, clinical and non-clinical, it's all the same. We're here to provide the best customer service for our patients and also as a professional, you stand in the space of ethics, integrity, and being honest. So we're going to have a lot of fun going through um, the law and ethics course, as you see through the book, the different uh, topics that we'll be reviewing. So I look forward to working with everybody within the discussion forum. So if you need anything, please text or call me at any time. I am available. Until next time, journey well. Instructor Pamela here. Bye-bye.